Hello guys, Salem here and today we'll be making a portable stroboscope that will be powered with a Nibel battery and some white SMD LEDs approximately, uh, I mean, nine of the LEDs, white SMD LEDs that will be soldered, will be soldered here so 3.3 on this perf board, this bigger one on this second perf board here will be soldered uh, the brain of this whole operation that is Arduino Pro Mini and a couple other electronical components like voltage, 5 volt voltage regulator because Arduino is using 5 volts and we are powering it with an idle battery so this stroboscope will have uh, 5 different modes of blinking uh, that will be controlled, the speed of those blinkings will be controlled with the potentiometer and uh, modes will change every time we press this switch that's the idea okay uh, i already programmed this arduino pro mini uh, as you know the arduino pro mini doesn't have an spi chip so we need this programmer we hook this up and connect it to pc and write program program it the code will be in a download in the script in the description down below Okay, so that's basically it for the intro, now let's start building. Okay, so first thing that we're going to build is the main uh, front panel of a stroboscope, I mean, let's say, let's call it a display. And we need to solder the SMD LEDs on this. So, first thing to do is, and the most important thing before soldering, is to apply the flux on the board. There is no SMD without a flux. These LEDs are SMD but they are a bit bigger so they can be soldered with the soldering iron. So we are going to solder SMD with soldering, soldering iron. And that's it. Okay, let's start. While doing this, keep in mind that uh, LEDs all are polarized, of course, and keep in mind to uh, turn all LEDs in one direction. So, in my case, I'm going to set all my LEDs to this side. To, uh, this side will be a cathode side, so negative side. In my case here, negative side is uh, has a little dot that indicates that this is a cathode or a minus lead of an LED. Okay, so now let's do the first row. So the first row will be soldered like this. And now after doing this, after soldering these three LEDs, uh, in the middle I'm going another three LEDs, and here another three LEDs. Okay, so now let's solder this first row here. Okay, so I just soldered the first row, so on this side, all uh, this left side, all LEDs are uh, turned that this is a cathode, so is this and this one, so we can connect them later together. A positive side of LED will go to Arduino, so every LED is connected to one of the pins on the Arduino, so Arduino will control every pin individually. Okay, so le now let's do the two more rows here. Okay, so once we uh, solder all these rows, we need to connect the grounds, the minus leads of the all LEDs, we need to connect them together. And we are going to do this with this wire. Okay, so let's... 
Okay, my camera stopped recording. I was out of memory. I didn't do much. I just soldered all the negative LEDs like this. You know, what's left to do is to connect all the positive leads of the LEDs to uh, Arduino. So basically, we're going to first solder some wires on them from this side, and then that all will be connected to another perf board that will be that per on that perf board the Arduino will be soldered. So let's do that now. Before connecting uh, this, before connecting LEDs to Arduino, uh, first we are going to uh, solder the Arduino on this perf board, solder voltage regulator, deal with the power, connect everything. And at the end, we are going to connect LEDs to this uh, Arduino. So let's do this. Okay, so Arduino is solar. Now let's solder the voltage regulator. Okay, voltage regulator is soldered. I'm gonna cut the headers off. Okay. Now, from the voltage regulator, uh, we are going to connect to Arduino, and on a voltage regulator, we are going to connect this 9V battery clip connector. So let's do that. Okay, we just connected the positive terminal and now we need to connect the ground. Okay, and the ground is connected as well. Now we need to connect uh, the switch that will go on this side so not on this side it will go on this side switch is going here and that potentiometer that's going to adjust the speed and we need to connect them to an Arduino as well so let's do that Okay, we connected, we just soldered the switch, now we need to solder the potentiometer. Okay, we just soldered the potentiometer and now we need to connect this switch to Arduino and connect this potentiometer to Arduino. Okay, so I just connected the switch and the potentiometer and that's a lot of wires. Schematic will be in description down for you. And that's that's it for the power and for that other perf board. Now let's get back to the first one. 
Now we need to connect all of these LEDs, positive lead of the LEDs, we need to connect it to Arduino. So basically we are going to solder a wire to each of them and this perf board will go underneath this one and they will be connected to some, I don't know, maybe with hot glue or something and wires will be connected here to Arduino. Okay, so now let's solder wires here and we are finishing this project. We are close to the end. Okay, now I just cut it a nine pieces of wires and we are going to solder them now. And now keep doing that for all of these rows. Okay, we are almost done. These are all connected wires. And now all of these wires need to be connected to the second perf board to Arduino. So we are going in. I written in code. So this is the first LED, first, second, third. 4th, 5th, 6th, 7th, 8th, 9th. So basically in that order we are going to connect them. So first LED goes to 3rd pin on the Arduino. 2nd LED goes to 4th pin and so on. So let's do the final step and after that we need to fix everything together and that's it. I hope. I just soldered all the positive leads of the LEDs to Arduino. It's a bunch of wires and of course this ground was connected to ground too. So we need to test this out and see does it work. Okay. 9 volt battery goes to, into this clip. Just a second. Okay. Okay, so this works basically. Let's change the mode. Okay, we can change the speed as well. So when we turn this potentiometer, see, we got a blink. Now I've just changed the mode. Now it's a different mode. There are far five modes here now. See, third mode. There's the fourth. Basically, there's a. It's really bright light. You can you can see the animation really well. But that's it. Okay. I'm a little bit blind from the soul light from all of this white light. And what's left to do is to somehow fix these two together and deal with this wires. I don't know how am I going to do it. Okay, like this. I just twisted them. And I'm going to lower them somehow. Basically what I did to fix them, I just hot glue everything and they are fixed now and basically that was the done project i hope you liked it thanks for watching if you like this video press the like button if you don't press the dislike button thanks for watching and see you next time